first grade, my mom and dad told me they had enrolled me into a Chinese immersion school. I looked at them and I was like, no. I said this because I had only been in America for two years and I barely had my fundamentals down in English. I said this not knowing how this would impact me in the future. So one of the most important things about learning a new language is when's the good time to learn it. So the good time to learn it is between the ages of one to 10. This is because your mind's still developing and it like accepts fresh ideas. Uh, there's a quote in Arabic that says, learning at, at a young age is like carving into a rock. If you learn after the age of 10, you can still learn a new language, but you might not, you might not be as fluent as you can be. If you learn after the age of 16, it is very difficult, not impossible, but very difficult. So there are many, many good, um, good things you learn from learning a new language that will help you in your future. But if I say them all, all I would say until tomorrow to say. So I'm just gonna tell you a few of the most important ones. So being creative, thinking critically, and problem solving is one because it's one thing and you're looking at it from different different perspectives which allows you to see stuff that other people cannot see. Another thing is multitasking. This happens because your brain has so many thoughts going through it and you have to talk with one person in one language, talk with another person in another language, but you start multitasking and it turns into habit and you start doing it even more. Well, the one I think and a lot of people think is the most important is memory. So you guys are thinking, okay, memory, I'm just gonna win a match game against my friend. Okay, who cares? But it actually lowers the chances of Alzheimer's and delays dementia for at least five years. So I'm saying future, future, future. You're like, okay, what's about future? Well, when most of us think of future, we think of jobs. And every job out there, if you know a better language, you will, you will have a better chance of improving and getting accepted into the job. For example, if you want to be a businessman and you want to start or expand your um, company, and you want to work with uh, different people from out of the United States, if you speak the dealer's language, they'll be more comfortable and more likely to do the deal with you. Also, if you are if you want to be a doctor, which I'm pretty sure a lot of your parents want you guys to be, or you guys want to be, too. Um, just take a scenario. You have two people to choose from, same PhD, same diploma, same everything, but one knows an extra language, and then you probably shouldn't be him because for the patients that don't know English, they're more comfortable with them. So I have a diagram here that shows, that shows a brain of a monolingual and a bilingual. So there are three parts. This diagram shows three parts of the brain. And the darker, the more developed, the more in-depth that part of the brain is. So the first part is the frontal, frontal uh, section. This deals with emotional expression, problem solving, memory, and language. So as you can see, a bilingual brain, which by the way means you know more than two languages, is a lot darker than the mon monolingual brain. Also, the other part is the temporal loop, the temporal loop, which deals with interpreting visual information, processing language, and mathematics. And as you can see, peri uh, the bilingual brain has a darker shade, which means it's more developed. And last but not least is the temporal part of the brain, and um, it, this deals with vision, memory, sensory input, emotions, and as you can see, again, the bilingual brain has is darker, which means it's more developed. So. So learning a new language will help you a lot in your future, future from all the good character, characteristics. So all I can do now is encourage other people to learn one too. So if you want any of the good characteristics that I said, then one of the easiest ways is to learn a new language. Thank you. Mm -hmm.